What is going on, guys? Welcome back to Life is Strange. Because, I don't know. Before the storm! We're back, guys. Um, Luminati. Guys, it is currently 5.44. Hey, I gotta turn down my game. Where's my controller? Hey, hey. The hell? The fuck? Out of the car, Chloe. You're gonna be late. Step douche. TV at 10. Oh, uh, he's a stepdad, so he fucking sucks, whatever. Whatever. You're welcome. You're a douchebag, bro. Step parents suck. Alright, guys, we are back. I haven't played this game in for fucking ever, alright? Uh, I took a little break from it. I don't know why. I think, uh, I got bored of it. <laughs> I only did, like, one episode on it, I think, and then I got bored, gave up on it. I do that with a lot of series, so for now on, we're going to do one series at a time, and we're going to fucking get through it, alright? Uh, I'm going to get back to Mass Effect, haven't played that game in almost uh, two years, I think it's almost been, I think, if I'm right, maybe just a year, but feels like two years to me, but uh, whatever. Uh, it could even be longer, guys, um, but yeah, we are going to continue fucking series, guys, um, and Mass Effect is fucking high recommended for some reason. Uh, even though no one watches my videos, so just get comments from people. Alright, uh, I'd really like if he played Mass Effect again, but I'm not gonna watch it. But, sure, uh, I'll bring it back someday. Um, I think I played it again a while ago. I barely remember it, though, but it was a good game. Uh, let's get right back into the fucking game now. Hell, All I remember is... Black Hell. Uh, Black Hell. Oh, she said Black Hill, not Black Hell. Well, it's school, so it probably is hell, too. Alrighty, but yeah, it's 5... What time is it? 5.46, and I got school tomorrow. I slept in until 6 o'clock today. I'm a bum, guys, so I'll probably be up until school, come back home, probably sleep again all day. This place looks like a fucking shithole. So all I remember is we were going to a bar or something like that. We hey, got in, Chloe. Oh. fucked some people up. Hey, Elliot. Wait, what Elliot? happened to your face? Do you need to go to the nurse or something? Hmm. What? This? You should. Why the fuck would you need to go to a nurse's office for a little scar? Not not a scar, but a little bruise. Oh my god, it's a bruise! You better get to the nurse's office right now. See the other guy. Fucking pussy. Yes, it's true then. I heard you had a hell of a night. I mean, people are talking about it. People can eat a dick. Even social media haters can't ruin how awesome last night was. So, how about the Tempest? Blackwell Theater at its most pretentious. Yeah, totally. I know it's gonna be lame, but I was thinking. Do you want to go together tomorrow? Ugh. That sounds awful. This guy looks like a fucking simp, so I'll just give him a maybe. I try to make it a rule not to go to school any more than I have to. But sitting in the back row and making fun of the drama kids might not suck. Right? That's totally what I was thinking. All right. See you in camp. Yeah, for sure. I wish I could have been to a college dorm. Not to learn, but, you know, I could possibly easily lost my virginity there. I gotta track down Steph to pick up my DVD. Alrighty, uh, you should eat, like, some food. You're looking very thin. Probably, like, I'm guessing you're probably, like, a 130, maybe, 120. Don't need to go look at that shit. Alrighty. Steph. What the fuck? Hey, I'm at the picnic tables with... Oh, I thought that said Hickey. <laughs> I'm at the picnic tables with Mickey. People make fun of my reading, but if you are a human with emotions, I do have a learning disability, so I'm slow. All right. Whatever. Do I have step douche on here? Oh, I don't. That's probably for the best. Wait, who the fuck was that? Ah, uh, too late now. Don't know where to go. Alrighty! Oh, what's this? Get DVD from Steph. 
Do we have a cell phone? You can like put schedules or like things to do. All right, here we go. Okay, can I go in here maybe? Good luck, seniors. What the hell? Fucking loser. What have you got here? Twitch. <gasps> Don't call me that. True North. A jock so dumb he makes jocks look bad. I guess Nathan Prescott Ew. made the shit list. Oh wow. This is some really weird crap, Prescott. It's not yours. Give it back! I hate that you're on the team now. You're such a loser. <laughs> Probably true. Guys, no need to fight. You can both be losers. The mute speaks? Whoa, whoa! You earn a spot on the squad, Twitch. You don't have your dad try to buy off the coach. At least my family pays tuition. How much financial aid does your deadbeat dad need again? Wow. Dick move, Nathan. My dad lost his job at the shipyard when your dad closed it down. And you want to talk shit to me? Leave Nathan alone. You know something? I ain't helping guy? Nathan. He's a douchebag. I'm do you a favor. You can't be a part of the team and be into this stupid crap at the same time. Ew, what, what was that? Did you see how he looked? You're a piece of shit. I am going stop to it. kill you. You guys, stop! Chloe, do something! Don't just stand there watching! I ain't doing shit. This piece of shit shot me. <laughs> yeah, uh, no thanks. Stay out. Hey, if you don't take the time to stand back and watch, you miss some of life's finer moments. Like, Booyah. that. Dude, if there's no fucking marker on it, you can easily get that out and just fucking dry it. Like, just leave it sit somewhere. I've literally dropped toilet paper in the sink before as I was doing shit, like, uh, brushing my teeth. I literally just picked the toilet paper out of the uh, sink and put it on the counter. And next day later, it was just a little damp. Still used it. <laughs> that took me months to put together. Quit the team, Twitch. Or next time it'll be worse. Yeah, he's gonna blame us. Oh, like, he's gonna be like, thanks a lot. <laughs> he's a fucking loser. I don't, are you a simp over him? You should be ashamed. You should go fucking drown yourself in a tub, you college whore. See, he picked it out of the water. It's gonna be fine. He's just a little fucking bitch. It's just gonna be a little bit of damp paper. Mom. Oh, fuck. Let me see. Oh, here we go. Let's see what we got from this thick bitch. Yep, don't give a fuck. See ya, bitch. Alright, let's get to school. What the fuck? Need my DVD from Steph. No one's gonna listen to that. Nerding it up. Maybe if I delay going inside long enough, Blackwall will be overrun by future excellence. And by future excellence, I mean mole people. Oh, wait. Wait a minute. Where the, where the fuck do I go? The dorms aren't in there? That must be where to study. The dorms probably aren't over here. Hey, man. See, now I wish I actually would have made it to college. I would have to fucking learn, but there's football, dude. I, that, I would have fucking joined, bro. I didn't make it through all of school. I didn't join football, so it's gonna be fucking hard as shit if I no, want to join someday. Chloe. Class is back the other way. Dude, I tried going to fucking class, but I just said look. Damn, that's a person that in college I'd want to fuck, dude. Seriously. I'll only make myself sound cool saying Stephen I go to Martin college. Shut the fuck up. I only say I go to college just to be cool, but I think I am a semester because the place I'm studying at is a college. So am I going to college or not? Okay, it's probably this way. Dude, if it's not, I'm gonna be fucking pissed. This controller sucks, by the way. It's a little touchy. Alrighty, a wall. Let's see what's on the wall. Ooh! Don't get caught, bitch.
Let's do this one. Last night's show was too epic. Dude, I got a freaking achievement. Oh, that's so cool. Dude, where the fuck do I go? Does it expect me to look at that stupid drug shit? Maybe it's this way. No, no. Chloe. Class is Dude. back the other way. Unbelievable. Good thing I can like edit, so maybe I can just take my plate myself to the place I need to go. So smart guys, I go to Share Factory now and know how to edit now. Like I cut bet shit you out. And Mikey are playing games on one of the tables. Oh yeah, the picnic tables. Where where's the shit at? Hmm picnic tables. Ugh There's that bitch. I'm not even gonna bother talking to her. There's a picnic table. It's probably these two losers right here. Ew. Probably the biggest losers in school. If I had known the Definitely. Danger was bloody, I would have totally given him my potion. It was a skill skill challenge. Like a fucking dweeb. Potion wouldn't have worked. Skill challenge? It's part of the tabletop game we play. You wouldn't understand. Play fucking Dungeons and Dragons? That's what it's look like. Try to... Give me a break, nerds. I've heard of tabletop games. Cool. Got my DVD? One it's Dungeons and Dragons. I literally see shields and swords on there. Sweet. Five bucks, right? Keep it. I'm just glad someone here appreciates the classics. You even asked for the director's cut. I love took classics. Took a shitty voiceover and replaced it with a sweet dream sequence. Dream life over real life. That's my motto. Right on. Hey, do you know if Rachel's a gamer? Rachel Amber. You're asking me? Two Did first names. Did you go out last night, or was it just, like, a friend thing? What's it to you? We're not friends. Uh, she saved me, so obviously we kind of are. Uh, what's it to you? Why do you want to know? <laughs> Steph has a crush. Chloe, you should join her game. Yeah, I don't have 50 hours right now. Thanks, though. We're at the end of the campaign, so it'll only take like 20 campaign. minutes. Campaign? What else have you got to do before class? Some other time. Not I ain't up really for that shit. Mood. Maybe later. You know where to find us. DVD? Okay. Check. Next stop, chemistry class. One, we dress like Good illusion, boy. our clothes looks filthy. Two, this girl's a fucking lesbo because this guy said she has a crush. Three, and final, this guy's a fucking loser. Plus, you sit like that, you're going to have poor circulation like I do because I used to sit like that all the time. Now, every fucking winter, my legs hurt. I don't know if that's normal, but yeah, it does, and they feel numb. Even when I'm in like a heated blanket, my legs hurt. And it's always winter. Summer? I feel like a new fucking man. If I'm late to class, that's just one more excuse for mom. Hey, I tried going out. in here. I tried. Jesus. Oh, good. You're here. Who the fuck are you? <laughs> I do beseech you. Chiefly that I might set it in my prayers. What is your name? Miranda. Oh, my father. I have broke your hest to say so. Good. Admired Miranda. Indeed worth what's dearest Wait. in the world. Many a lady I have eyed with best regard, and many a time have listened to... Many a time, the harmony of their tongues... Hath I listened to... Hayden. You're killing me. You've had weeks to be off book. Sorry, Mr. Keaton. No, don't apologize to me. Apologize to your scene partner who's been very accommodating, and to your other fellow actors, and most of all, to yourself. Mr. Keaton, sorry. This freaking story is stupid. Not the story, the game, their story. One, Keaton, I fucking hate that name. I used to be friends with a freaking Keaton. He was a snob, asshole. Just had to let that out. Uh, second, 
uh, in the play, her father is a black guy. That makes no sense. No one is going to fall for that shit unless she is adopted. They do not have good taste in actors because if that was her dad, he's like freaking, they're like the same age, so he had to have had kids when he was like two. Unbelievable. Up, but does this look better? I had my mom take it in a bit. Rachel Look like a looks awesome. No, she she looks like a this fucking granny. Surreal as last night. Looking good, Rach. Very cool. Exquisite, Rachel, as always. Mr. Keaton, I'm still having trouble with. My affections are then most humble. I have no ambition to see a goodlier man. I mean, does she really mean that? Especially because I just straight out told her I've been banging all the ladies. <sighs> what yeah, the fuck? That is hard. We've talked about that line forever. We need a fresh perspective. The question is, are Miranda's feelings of instant passion for Ferdinand just inexperience in dramatic circumstances, or has she actually just met the love of her life? What do you think? Dude, this girl seems horny. Sometimes, when you meet someone who's going to change your life, you just know it, I guess. Also, you've got parents coming to see the show, right? At 20 bucks a ticket, it's gotta be true love. 20 wow. bucks? A romantic and a sick. Like fucking five. That actually kinda helps me. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks, Mr. Either. Keaton. Later. See you later, guys. Oh no. I have first period improv with a class full of freshmen now. Teacher obviously doesn't enjoy his life. Your eye looks fabulous. Where'd you get it done? Uh, what? <laughs> Just kidding. That asshole really clocked you. It wasn't a big deal. I'll just be a minute. Okay. So, why am I here again? Oh, could you grab my belt for me? I think it's in my bag over there. Uh, it's right. Y yeah. That is so fucking bait. She walked out just to tell me to do that when she could have fully came out and did it herself. She's got a vibrator in there or something that like a gift. Sure. Okay. Uh, get what the house Max at. Don't say any stupid shit and don't like fall down. Should be doable, right? <laughs> what the fuck is this shit? Is that supposed to be a shield? Alright, where's this bitch's backpack? It must be right here. Ooh. I have feelings about this. Why do theater kids take themselves so seriously? 100% the teacher probably wants to fuck someone. You guys can read all this shit. Alrighty, let's look in this bitch's backpack. She's probably got like something naughty in here. Rachel looks so happy here. Looks like someone was gonna rape her in the woods. She looks pretty scared. Hurt up, she said no fucking funny business. There's Rachel's belt. Guess I'll go give this to Rachel now. It's probably fucking fingering herself now. Ooh. Is this bitch nude? Good thing I can edit, because I'm gonna take a little peek for myself. You guys don't get to see. Uh Fuck! Rachel? Is this your belt? Unbelievable! Yes. <laughs> Thank you. <sighs> Unbelievable. So, ooh, bring it to her. You both are fucking girls. You have the same parts. What the fuck is this? That is unbelievable. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I didn't think you'd come back here. Thanks. So... Did you bring flowers for my dressing room? 
Just this belt. Uh, how about a belt instead? Perfect. Unbelievable. There's no way a girl could put on their bra that quickly. I'll let you finish changing now. I'm fucking believable. This game is so not exciting. Chloe Price. Rachel Amber. What a terrible fucking name, Rachel Amber. Who gives their daughter two first names? Unbelievable. Because that, that sounds like a first name. You can call her Am Amber or Rachel. Like, unbelievable. Last night was amazing. Like, what, what could her full name be? Like, Rachel Sally Amber? Getting attacked was amazing. You call getting attacked by goons amazing? I've got to hang out with you more. Deal. To tell the truth, I went to bed last night wishing it never had to end. I went to bed last night wishing I had a girlfriend. And I woke up, <laughs> there was no one there. But then I thought, why? Why does it have to end? Yeah, seriously, why? Why can't it happen? Maybe it doesn't uh, have to end. Mm -hmm. Exactly. How would you like to join me on a little field trip? Fuck yeah. I was literally just about to say that. Fuck yes. I was born to ditch. See, me and this Chloe chick, in reality, we'd be good fucking friends. Maybe back in the day, no, because I was more sensitive and kind of a little cunt back in the day. Now I'm a fucking badass. I'm a fucking man. I hoped you'd say that. No, about that I No, honestly, I'm that, still sensitive. I'm a little bitch. I'd probably Can hate you her. Cover it up with some makeup? I'll cover your asshole with makeup. No way. Are you kidding? This is a badge of honor. Ugh. Respect. Not get punched again. Let's get the hell out of here. No, 100%. I'd be good friends with Max and I'd bone her. I wouldn't have one. I'd bone her. Here we go. I wonder if we'll see Robert Downey Jr. in this game. The the history teacher, whatever the fuck he was. Is this the hangout? Grab the bus or Nope. If we're gonna go rogue, we're doing it right. Did she spank me? Well what the hell am I getting into here? Uh 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 I don't know what the fuck's been wrong with me, but I've been having like freaking uh I don't know what's been going on, but I've been having like these little muscle spasms in my uh bicep. North? Maybe we'll end up in Seattle. It's annoying. Pull up a chair, Price. The view's amazing. Elliot! Ah, oh, this fucking loser. Hey, wait, let me read it! Okay, hang on. Why is the guy be spelt like that? That's hard to see and read. It's not an excuse because I'm a terrible reader. Oh my god, let me see it. Elliot. Here we go. Hey! What? Is that say, hey, why weren't, why weren't you in Chem? What the fuck's that mean? Chem? What the fuck's a Chem? What? Is my reading that bad, guys? Does that say Chem? I don't know if I'm fucking dumb or need a new prescription. That, that looks like it says Chem. Why weren't you in Chem? Or does that say chem, short for chemistry? I don't know. Everything okay? Yep. I heard shit went down with Drew and Nathan. Did you see? <laughs> Yo, let's talk later. Okay. Guys, my reading's terrible. I have to practice for a poem uh, months ago, before November, to a teacher at my school. And so far, I haven't read it to them yet. 
I read it once for practice, but they didn't like how I was too shy and didn't like how I was talking slow and like looking at it carefully and then pausing, reading it again. So, so far, I think they forgot about it, so I won't bring it up. Wants me to so, yeah. pull up a chair. Maybe one of these crates. Pull up a chair. But yeah, honestly, in my opinion, I think my reading's kind of bad. Things heavier than it looks. Guess I should sit down. All right, Chloe. You're on a freaking train with Rachel freaking Amber. They're gonna fuck. Play it cool. Is this nervousness? Is that what this feeling is? Wish Max were here so I could ask. Should I make small talk? Is that what people do? Nice weather. It's nice Rachel we're having. <laughs> what? I mean weather. It's nice weather. What a fucking idiot. It sure is. So, it's kind of weird that we're hanging out. You mean because I don't hang out with anyone and I don't have any friends? You have friends. Well, I used to. <laughs> Friend. Singular. Her name is Max, but she left for greener, more northern pastures. That sucks. Say thanks after she said that sucks. That makes no fucking sense. Remain silent. Yeah, let's do that. That's me right there. If I was with someone I liked. <laughs> Wondering what we're doing. The thought occurred, yeah. Well, I wanted some company. That's it? That's it. I love company. <laughs> Good to fucking go. Anything beats another second in Blackwell. You really hate it there, don't you? You don't? <laughs> right. What reason would Rachel Amber have for hating Blackwell Academy? Your high school royalty. You don't know me. Yet. Let's do something fun. Ugh. Flirt? Um, sure. Okay, I'm listening. Two truths and a lie. What? I think we should what? play Two Truths and a Lie. It's a game where each person offers up three facts about themselves, two of which are the truth, and one of which is uh -huh. a lie. Right. And then the other person has to guess which is which. Mm -hmm. Sounds fun. Sounds fun. You're on. I'll start. First, I'm ambidextrous. Second, I was born in New York, the land of fashion and Broadway, to which I will one day return when my heinous exile here in Arcadia Bay comes to an end. New York, huh? I've never been. Not a world traveler? Not yet, at least. If you could travel anywhere, where would you go? Russia, Greece, Kathmandu? What? Kathmandu? One day, I'm going to climb Everest. Have fun There's fucking dying. Arcadia Bay was ambitious. What's your third thing? My third thing? Two truths and a lie. You say three things. Right. I'm a Leo. Meow. Okay. <laughs> so, ambidextrous. Born in New York and a Leo. Gotcha. So, which is the lie? 
You are so lying that you're a Leo. You're way too lucky to be a Leo. You've got to be a Sagittarius or something. The Archer? That's what my, that's what my brother is. Well, that'd be cool. Like Artemis. But I'm afraid I was telling the truth. What? Serious? I have nothing against Leo. I'm just... <laughs> I was just being an idiot. Play. Hear me roar. <laughs> no, the lie was New York. I've never been there, though I want to one day. I was born in Long Beach. New York's on the bucket list, then. Sounds good. Okay, your turn, Price. First fact. Right. Something about myself. Should I start things off with a lie or with the truth? Or should I cheat? Let's see how good she really is at this game. Um, let's, let's lie. I'm in a band. I'm allergic to cats. I broke my hand punching someone. <laughs> um, n hang on. Let's let's do truth first. All right. Country music makes me throw up. Yeah, a lot of it today does make me too. I'm uh, as I said, I'm more into classics. I, country singers I like is Kenny Chesney. Um. I think Toby Keith is a country singer too. And I like Blake Shelton. And I think that's about it. I heard of a guy named Keith Urban. I don't know if he's a country singer though. Alright, well, yeah. Alright. I love science. Yeah, let's do that one. I love science. Seriously, I think Neil deGrasse Tyson is the shit. Huh. Ha ha ha. Alright, now let's go to a lie. Hmm. You know, I'm just kidding. Uh, let's go back to truth again. Let's do the country music one. I used to love country music when I was a kid. Now it makes me want to throw up. Literally. That's weird. Two, wait, three truths? Let's do I'm in a band. Make I'm it obvious. I'm the lead guitarist of an all girl misfits cover band called The Misfits. You idiot! You could have just said I was in a band. Idiot, that's way too unbelievable. No one's gonna believe that. Impressive. You're hella mysterious, Chloe Price. Uh, hella? <laughs> Who says that? It's a Cali thing. Anyway, I think I have your number. I'm not sure why country music makes you throw up. I'm a complex girl, Rachel. I think it's probably true. Also, I kinda like the Dixie Chicks. You and David both. No accounting for taste. Who's David? <laughs> An asshole, yes! He's just... some asshole. Who likes the Dixie Chicks? He's an asshole my mom's dating, I guess. And you don't like him. He's a step douche. <laughs> it's still so weird. I'm gonna tell you guys a legit true story. This is no fucking lie, and it pissed me the fuck off. I'm not gonna lie. My bathroom door is a sliding door, and it the lock doesn't even fucking work, and the door is crooked. So whoever half-assed this house remodeling did not even put the door on right. So I was showering, and right as I was about to get out, that fat motherfucker walks in on me. Good thing I'm still behind the curtain because he's a fucking weirdo. Usually a normal person would react like, oh, they'd go out and close the door like, oh, I'm so sorry about that. I should have knocked. He literally just opens the door just fucking staring at me like, dude, get the fuck out of here. If I was 17, I'd call the cops on you immediately. I'd get you, I'd get any way to put you in prison, bro. Like, just standing there saying, oh, wow, I, I didn't think you were in here. I because he was confused why the light was on. Why the why else would the fucking light be on? 
in my, just, oh my god, just go fuck, fuck yourself, you fat motherfucker, alright? He's just staring at me, and he's, he was, uh, wondering why the ceiling fan wasn't on. It was fucking on. The ceiling fan is kind of in the light bulb. There's a big circle opening, and the light bulb's in the middle, and the, the hole, like a donut, is where the ceiling fan is. It's in the light. And I go, it is on, but the shower's on, so you obviously can't hear it. And he's still just standing there staring at me. And he eventually gets out because my mom shouts, what the fuck are you doing? Um, he immediately gets out and shuts the door. And I, I, hear, I hear him say, I didn't think he was in there and I'm the one who's paying the damn bills. Like, dude, go, go fuck yourself. You're a retired fat motherfucker. You get money unlimited for the rest of your life every fucking month. You shouldn't have nothing to cry about anymore. You piece of shit, fat pat, you, you pot belly, cheapskate piece of shit. Just, I wish I could grab his fucking head, put his hair in a fucking toaster and burn it. Like, just go fucking die and pour gasoline down your ass. Just do anything. This is why I hate step parents. They are all snobbish pieces of shit. Here, that she's dating someone. Back to my the game. Dad and my mom. <laughs> they were totally in love. You can tell how fucked up she is now just by how she's settling for It's probably why I'm a depressed piece of shit these days because I have to put up with people like him. He's this total hard ass ex military jagoff type. The opposite of my dad. Oh, that sucks. Yeah. David has no respect. He acts like I'm some kind of problem to solve. Sometimes I am a problem though. That's a load of bullshit. Oh, she better not be agreeing with that. If I talk shit about my stepdad and the person was like, Oh, no, he can't be that bad. Go fuck yourself. You never met the man. If you did, you need to live with the guy. You you can't just meet him once saying, Wow, that was a, he was such a nice guy. You did not get to know him more. Trust me. Me being a... Since I know him for sadly almost 10 fucking years, when I am by him, I just feel like I want to shoot myself just to get away from him. Let's see what this bitch says. What do you mean? You're not a problem, Chloe. You're a person. Fuck. It sounds like the only problem is David. You need to hit him where it hurts. Ooh, right in the, the dick. The only thing that David loves has four wheels and a four-barrel carburetor. Oh, God. A muscle car? I'm probably going to steal it soon, so... <laughs> Let me know if you need an accomplice. That's gonna be the... That's... What this video is going to be called, Life is Strange Before the Storm, uh, part two, I think this is. Step parents suck. It's what the thumbnail is going to be, or the title, I mean. Okay. You say you love science, but you are failing chemistry. Oh. You're saying failing chemistry means I hate science? Or that Blackwell doesn't inspire your best work? That place is a hellhole filled with shit, where shitty people go to be shitty to each other and themselves. <laughs> Tell me how you really feel, though. Anyway, school sucks, but you love science. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna say true. Ha! Wait. So, let's talk about this lead guitarist business. The business of show. Wait, I I did say frickin' I d truth was science. She was supposed to say no, dude. As she much won. As I'd love to be a groupie to your all-girl cover band, The Misfits. I'm gonna have to call lie on that one. There's no way you'd ever be a groupie. Okay, that's fair backup dancer with vocals obviously the problem is your hand is smooth no calluses you don't play guitar pity too you'd look hot on stage i'm fucking believable no wonder why she was feeling my so, hand she cheated if my math is correct you told me two truths and one lie what you expected me to cheat winners make their own rules chloe you are crazy good at this game. 
a lifetime of studying the human condition. If I did all three truths, would she have fucking got them all right? <sighs> well, I'm impressed. I bet it's hard to impress Chloe Price. I'm gonna feel good about that one. When your dad is the district attorney, I guess lying is something you're used to. Seriously? Seriously. I know who to call if I need to get out of a ticket then. Not that I have a right of my own. Car first, an embarrassing number of moving violations second. Hey, thanks for trusting me. Trusting you? You played the game. Also, you told me about that dickwad David. Now he's on my shit list too. Hell yeah. Too bad people don't have a shit list for my step douche. You opened up a lot. That's all. You want to know something funny? My mom was super busy one day. And uh, she couldn't take me to school one time. And I was I had an appointment for an, uh, an important test. Because the person I need to be working with has a certain schedule. Because she's got other people. And mine was set for um, 9.30 about. And so my mom was busy the whole day cleaning and doing shit. And step prick had to take me. Just to be a fucking asshole purposely, he took every fucking long way you could possible. I was supposed to be there at 9.30, right? It doesn't matter if you're late, but for an uh, appointment for that test, you have to be there. So I had to reschedule like fucking twice because when he took every long way just to be a piece of shit, I got there at like 11.30 and it was the, the test was set at 9.30. Dude, that is so fucking disrespectful. Like... I wish I could just grab the steering wheel and turned off, turned, like, left off the road. I'd be the only survivor. It's not a big deal. Hate to break it to you, but Chloe Price is not exactly renowned throughout Arcadia Bay as a bastion of trust and empathy. Trust doesn't exactly come easy to me. Maybe if you'd had my life. You'd understand. No, I get that. On the other hand, I got on this train with you, didn't I? Fair point. They're gonna fucking make out. I wouldn't mind listening to some music. Got some uh, DNC on there, or like Jealous from Nick? Hmm? Share, share with her. Hey, you want to listen? Come on, what are you fucking listening to? When was this game made? I think DNC should have been a man, right? <laughs> oh, music's off. Yeah, I want to see if it's like Cake by the Ocean or something. Let's see, guys. Does anyone like Cake by the Ocean? Um. I can't switch shit. What? This is unbelievable. It does not want me to hear the music. This is so unbelievable. That is so unfair, guys. Can you only change the settings in the main menu? Wow, I can't even change anything in here. Whoa! What the fuck? Yeah, now. Yeah, let's see what this shit was. What the fuck is this shit? That is not DNC. Unbelievable. Here, do it.
solo. It's a drum solo. Alright, guitar now. Now we're gonna do like a. What's this shit done, dude? My demo cannot last this long, dude. <sighs> that weird me out. Let's get the fuck out of here. How long is that gonna take? Whew, doing all that really weird me out. I'm never joining the band. Well, bracelet. I've had it, I guess, since I was a kid in Long Beach. Reminds me that there's more to experience out there than just Arcadia Bay. Maybe one day I'll go back to Long Beach. Or anywhere but here. Maybe sooner than later. I hear ya. Me too. Arcadia Bay can suck a bag of dicks. Sometimes <coughs> I feel like I've got no reason to stay. Don't be surprised, Chloe. Dude, look how close they are. They're gonna fuck soon. I'm just out of here. Let me know if you need an accomplice. Check it out. We're here. Whoa. We're at our hangout what? from this, the is Life is Strange Don't game. First out. one. Did you say jump? Jump. Jump, you fucking bitch. Fuck it. Ah. We're at the hangout from when Chloe showed Max that ugly little fucking abandoned shit by the train where Chloe got stuck on or whatever. Obviously, we're here. Where the fuck are we? This isn't, this isn't a hangout. Guys, I'm a legit pussy, but I've been really wanting to play, uh, Horror games recently. I want a little thrill. Or whatever the word I'm looking for is. I want a little scare in me. Wish they'd make another Outlast game. Where the hell are we going? Hey, it's actually a pretty nice view. Glad Fuck you yeah. Leave. And as your reward for making it up here, I have a new game for us to play. Really? Another one. How about Tic Tac Fuck? One. I like games. Deal with it. This is one I learned in theater class. It's all about improvisation. I know all the world's a stage and shit, but I'm not an actor. Really? I see you acting like you're tough all the time in school. I... That's... Damn it. This game involves spying on people from afar. Luckily, we've got some high-tech surveillance equipment right here. Let's fire it up. Maybe we can find, like, two people fucking on the lake or something. What an idiot. What the fuck's that white beam that's that flying across? Was. Out of order. Well, shit. That was my last quarter. You? Quarterless. Damn. Hey, maybe I can MacGyver something up. I've been told I'm pretty handy. Oh, yeah? Let's see what you got. Maybe grab like a brick and smash the telescope? 
Rachel really wants to use this viewfinder. I'd love to get it working for her. Huh. Looks like I might be able to pry it open with the right tool. I'm not getting in there with just my fingers. Maybe Rachel has something I can use? Do you have like a tampon? Uh, I'm thinking about prying open that viewfinder. Got a knife on you? A knife? Yeah. My mom took mine. Uh, no. How about a nail file? The whole piece of shit's probably gonna I guess break. You could stab someone with a nail file. Oh, right. Sh sure, let's try it. Victoria. Clear price. I heard some fucked up shit from Nathan about you. Who do you think you are? You don't know anything about him, you dumb fucker. Is that what that said? Oh, come on. These bitches are just blowing up on each other. Alright, let me see the rest of the message. Last thing I saw was you dumb fucker. Wait, what was that? What? Wait, this is a stupid fucking mom. There's this bitch. Oh, you dumb fuck up. I was pretty good at keeping up, kind of. <laughs> Go back to your trailer. <laughs> what a bitch. By the way, Rachel Amber obviously played you last night. You'll be lucky if she ever talks to you again. <laughs> I'm with the bitch right now. Oh shit. Why didn't I see that? I'm so hurt. This is just the beginning, bitch. <laughs> this is the type of bitch I'd go up to, smack her in the ass, and just run away. Before I do that, I'm gonna see if I can actually find something. Cause I have a feeling this little fucking nail file is gonna break. Ah, oh, you know, I don't give a fuck about people's stuff. Let's go. Got a new tool. Pry this bitch open. Damn it. It always looks so easy in the movies. I wonder if I can find something sturdier to use. So I took this shit for nothing? What else am I gonna use? Wait. Show me. Did you have something in your. No. Totally gonna get you that quarter. Love the confidence. Would love a quarter even more. Even more. By the way, guys, since I know how to edit, I can put. I think I can t put two videos together so it's super long. So I'm gonna make my videos a little bit longer. I know, I know it's more space because I think it'll be gigabytes instead of make. or whatever it is. Whatever's before mega or uh, gigabytes, I think it's megabytes. I don't know. Alrighty, let's let's go this way. So yeah, it is currently six thirty-eight. I don't want to head down there just yet. What? The fuck, are we gonna use? It's gonna be like a something around here. Looks like this one might actually be working. Let's go take a look over here. There's obviously gonna be something over here. Yuck. Cliche much, AW and BW? Aw, and BW. Maybe her name is like Amber Williams or something? Look at like trash. I guess, I guess nature, nature doesn't, doesn't quite, quite provide. provide. Get out of here. 
totally use that. Why would you throw the nail file? That was your friends. Stealing a dedication plate takes persistence. <laughs> Steph. Hey, heads up. Wells is on the... Uh, what? Fuck. Seriously? Just trying to help. Huh. Oh my god, my reading is terrible. Hang on, let me go back. Who is that? Stuff. Come on, I've been going to school. Step up, bitch. Alrighty. Um, and, where's all that? Hey, heads up. Wells is on the... The rat? What? Fuck you, bitch. My reading is terrible. I have a horrible learning disability. I would always use excuses to my subscribers saying I have a bad prescription or my eyes hurt. Fuck that, guys. I can't read because I never finished school and I'm a fucking loser. Alrighty. Warpath. How is that so fucking hard to say? Unbelievable. I, I kept saying wrath or wrath. It's Warpath. Oh, no. Seriously? Just trying to help. Haha. -ha. We... Replicants gotta stick together. That that's better. What that it better have said that replicants. That's what that better says. Oh, I'm fucking stupid, guys. I don't blame you if you make fun of me, everyone. Like I'm terrible. I'm a fucking grown ass man. I don't yeah, know how to read. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, now it's the bird's turn. I'm gonna scare them off too. Hey, get out of here! Bye. What's next? Raccoon? <gasps> the squirrels are back! Mm. You sons of bitches! What's that? <laughs> oh, I thought I could like take the rope and make a trap. Get out of here! Get out of here, woodland creatures. Have some self-respect. Fucking time loop. It's gonna happen over and over. Alright. Let's use this little uh, plate. Problem. Press got power. Activate. We got the quarter. Game over. That was enough of a game for me. Your MacGyver skills are second to none. Except probably MacGyver. Rachel smells like Jasmine. Mm -hmm. Is she smelling me right now too? Really should have showered this morning. All right, here's the game. You find some people for us to spy on, and then mm -hmm. you and I will act out what they're saying and thinking. Mm -hmm. That's it. I do that in my head during like every class. See, you're a natural. Let's give it a try. <laughs> 